Hello friends, today I talk about in this video benefits of movement and regular exercise. What are the benefit? The what are the benefits of exercise and uh, the key component of healthy lifestyle? Regular movement, a significant stress reliever. Exercise increases blood circulation, enabling your body to better filter out stress hormones like cortisol from your system. Studies show that exercise has protective benefits against declining health because it combats stress, slow down the aging process and improves sleep habit. Moving regularly improves blood sugar balance by reducing circulating glucose levels in the body. This is one reason why people who part participate in some form of activity following a meal have improved prosprandial sugar levels. Give yourself 10 minutes before or returning to work from your lunch break to take a lap around the parking lot or consider doing the dishes immediately following dinner instead of waiting until the following day. Starter is for moving daily. Perform high intensity exercises by zoning in on specific muscle groups and elevating heart rate. Enjoy low density, enjoy low intensity exercises like swimming and walking. Enjoy moving, whether gardening or dancing. Use resistant bands for low impact strength training. Improve muscle tone and balance by learning yoga or meditation. How to do exercise regular? Engaging in regular exercise is essential for maintaining physical and mental health. Here is a comprehensive guide on how to incorporate regular exercise into your routine. Number one, set clear goals. Define your objectives. Decide what you want to achieve. Whether it is weight loss, muscle gain, improved cardiovascular health, or stress reduction. Set SMART goals. Make your goals specific, measurable, achievable, relevant, and time-bound. Number two, choose activities you enjoy, variety. Include different types of exercise to keep things interesting. Fun factor, choose activities you find enjoyable such as dancing, hiking, swimming, or playing sports. Number three, create a balanced workout plan. Cardiovascular exercise. Aim for at least 150 minutes of moderate intensity or 75 minutes of high intensity cardio per week. Examples include running, cycling, and brisk walking. Strength and training. Incorporate strength training exercise at least twice a week. Focus on all major muscle groups using weights, resistance bands, or body weight exercise like push-ups and squats. Flexibility and balance. Include activities like yoga, pilates, 
or stretching exercise to improve flexibility and balance. Number four, start slowly, a progress gradually. Easy into it. If you are new to exercise, start with a shorter session and gradually increase the duration and intensity. Warm up until cool down. Being each workout with a warm up and end with a cool down to prevent injuries and aid recovery. Number five, schedule your workouts. Consistent routine. Schedule your workouts at the same time each day to build a habit. Flexible timing. If a set schedule is challenging, aim for smaller boards of exercise throughout the day. Number six, listen to your body. Rest and recovery. Allow time for rest and recovery to prevent our training and injuries. Adjust as needed. Modify your workouts if you feel pain or discomfort and consult a healthcare professional if necessary. Number seven, track your progress. Keep a log. Use a journal, app, or fitness tracker to monitor your workouts and progress. Celebrate milestones. Acknowledge your achievement to stay motivated. Number eight, stay motivated. Find a workout buddy. Exercising with a friend can make workouts more enjoyable and keep your accountable. Mix it up. Vary your routine to avoid boredom and challenge your body in new ways. Set new challenges. Regularly set new fitness challenges or goals to keep yourself motivated. Number nine, incorporate daily activity. Stay active. Incorporate physical activity into your daily routine, such as taking the stairs instead of the elevator, walking or cycling to work, or doing household chores. Example weekly exercise plan. Monday. 30 minutes of moderate intensity cardio exercise. Example, brisk walk or cycling. 15 minutes of strength and training. Focus on upper body. Tuesday, 45 minute yoga session for flexibility and balance. Wednesday, 30 minutes of high intensity interval training. 15 minutes of strength and training. Focus on lower body. Thursday. Rest day or light activity. Example, leisurely walk or stretching. Friday. 30 minutes of moderate intensity cardio exercise. Example, swimming or jogging. 15 minutes of core exercise. Plank, erection twist, etc. Then Saturday, 45-minute group fitness class, zombie, spin, or boot camp. Sunday, 60-minute hike or outdoor activity. By incorporating these guidelines into your routine, you can develop a sustainable and effective exercise regimen that promotes overall health and well-being. Then what are the benefits of movement? Improve circulation, stimulates lymphatic drainage, enhance tissue oxygenation, balances 
key brain neurotransmitters, reduces stress and tension in body, improves mood and happiness, enhances mental clarity and memory. The difference between movement and exercise. Movement is a sort of movement you are doing at a low intensity without specific physic related goals. Exercise is something you are doing at a very high intensity with a goal to build strength, muscle, endurance, burn fat, etc. So this is all about the topic. Learn more, contact us or see for the next detailed videos. Good sleep and uh, reduce stress. Thanks for watching this video.